Hi, my name is Bala Gauri Shankar and I am from Chennai, Tamil Nadu. I am currently in the MBA 09 batch of IIM Bodh Gaya. I wrote my CAT 2022 and got an overall percentage of 98.74 with 99.7 in DILR and 99 in Quant. So Bala, how did you prepare for the CAT? So I started my preparation from the month of March. I joined a coaching institute and used only the materials provided by them. So my main focus was to learn all the basic concepts in all the areas. So I finished the materials within the month of August and from September I started getting my mock exams. As we all know, CAT has a strict time limit for each section. How did you manage your time effectively during the exam? CAT is an exam that doesn't test your knowledge. Rather, it tests your smart work in choosing the right questions. For VARC, you should first know your strength, whether it is VA or RC. For RC, go through all the questions and choose the passage that has more number of direct questions. For DILR, spend the first 5 minutes going through all the 4 sets and then rate them according to your level of difficulty. If you have rated them correctly, you would be able to solve 2 sets within the next 20 minutes and the 3rd set in the last 15 minutes. So you should be able to solve around 13 to 14 questions within the 40 minutes. And for quant, go through all the questions and rate them as easy, medium or difficult within the first 3 minutes and then start attempting all the easy questions. So the idea is you should not miss out on any of the easy questions. Use the method of elimination to arrive at the correct answer. What are some general tips for maintaining focus and staying calm during a high pressure exam like CAT? CAT is considered as a high pressure exam simply because you have not given this type of exam before, be it in your schooling or undergraduate. To overcome that, give as many mock tests as you can. Don't think of CAT as a single exam, rather than see it as three separate exams. So after giving a section, if you have not done well, it is important to forget that and start the next section afresh. How important is taking mock tests and how many did you take during your preparations? So mock are the only exams that give you the real feel of how a typical CAT exam would be. I started giving mocks from the month of September. I gave around 2 mocks per week. So within CAT, I gave around 20 mocks. So after giving a mock, I spent uh, the next 24 hours analyzing it and took a day break before attempting the next one. So within the two days, I focused on what my weak areas were and took sectional and chapter wise tests to focus on those weak areas. If you could give one piece of advice to CAT aspirants aiming for a high percentile in 2023, what would it be? So with around 7 weeks left for CAT, you must have found a strategy for attempting it. If not, develop a strategy and start implementing it in your mock. Don't try to copy a strategy from another person because it solely depends on your strengths and weaknesses. Try to give your mock in the day same time slot as of the actual CAT. So with it, I wish all the best to all the CAT 2023 aspirants.